Now we are going to see exercise 8.2. Write each of the following in words. 0.03, 0.03. So you have to write in words. 0.03, 0.03. That is what I have written in words. This is 0.03. Next we are going to sum. We are going to do that is what you are going to do 108.56 that is 108.56 100 and 8 point 5 6 108 point 5, 6, 108 and 108 also you can write no issues. Second question, write as a fraction in lowest term 0 0.60. So after the point you have to consider. So 60. So that is what you have written 60. So uh, after the point how many digit? 2 digit. That is what you divided by 100 because in 100 2 zeros are here. So 60 divided by 100. So this is a fraction of decimal 0 0.60. So first you have to convert this decimal um, as fraction. So 0 0.60 you have to convert into 60 by 100. So you must cancel for both zeros and 6 by 10. So 6 by 10 is divided by 2 and see sorry so here what you get 6 divided by 10 6 divided by 10 is divided by 2 and here also divided by 2 you can get 6 is divided by 2 you can get 3 and 10 is divided by 2 you can get 5 so the answer is 3 by 5 this is the right answer for this question next is 0 0.125 so you have to write after the point what is the number as given in the question you have to write after the point you have to write that particular number 125 that means one after the point you must read 125 but while you uh, while you convert into fraction you must write 100 and you must say 125 divided by 1000 so why do you write 1000 because after the point how many digit three digit that is what you have written 125 divided by 1000 so 125 divided by 1000 you can write and after that 125 divided by 1000 because you have to make it as a lowest form divided by so the same number what is the num numerator that is 125 even though you can divide it by 125 so 1000 also one divided by 125 so 125 divided by 125 you can get 1 and 1000 divided by 125 you can get 8 so this is the right answer for that question even though you can 125 multiply by 8 125 multiply by 8, 8, 8 5 is 40, 0 carry over is go to the top, 8 to 16, 16 plus 4, 20, 0 carry over 2 and 1 plus 1 into 8, 8 plus 2, 10, the answer is 1000, that is what, otherwise you can do 125 is divided by 5 and 1000 is divided by 5, it is a long process, you can get 25 divided by what you get, 10, what is this? 2, 10 is divided by 5, you can get 5 to are 10 and again you have to write the two zeros. Again 25 is divided by 5 and 200 is also divided by 5, you can get again 5 divided by what? 40. Okay. So 5 divided by 40 because 2, 20 is divided by 5, you can get 4 and 0 as it is right. And here also 5 is divided by 5, you can get 1 and 40 is divided by 5, you can get 1 by 8 is a right answer for the question. You can take any one of this method. Is a, this is a what bigger number division, this is a smaller number division. So which is your convenient. So if you are thorough in this, even the bigger table, you can do that. Otherwise, you can use this method. Any one of the method you can choose. It's not an issue. And third one, question number three, which is greater. 0 0.3 or 0 0.4. Solution, whole part, this is 0 0.3 or 0 0.4, which is a greater number. So this is the, uh, these two are decimal number. So you have to find out you sorry you have to find out which one is a greater number. But these two numbers are decimal. The first number is 0 0.3, second number is 0 0.4. So solution whole part for both is zero. So this is zero. This is also zero. So whole part for both is zero. And tenth part for 0 0.3 is tenth part. This is after the point 0 0.3 only you have taken. 
so tenth part tenth tenth part mean after the point what is a what is the part name what is the number three so this uh, digit name is nothing but what tenth three tenths okay so tenth part for zero point three is three and for zero point four is what this is the which is which one is the tenth part four so and for zero point four is four okay this is the tenth part zero point three tenth part is this is three is the tenth part and zero point four four is a what tenth part. So tenth part for zero point three is okay. Tenth part for zero point three is three, and for zero point four is four. So four is greater than three. Which one is greater? Four and three. Which one is greater? Four is greater than three. So zero point four is greater than zero point three. So zero point four is a right answer. Zero point four is greater. Is a greater number. I think so you understand the concept